The lighting here is a bit rough, so bear with me, guys. Currently, I'm in Miami on a business trip, my first business trip ever, so that's pretty cool. Anyway, I'm in Miami, and I thought, why not do a quick rundown of the iPad setup that I'm currently using? <laughs> So I decided to go lightweight with this trip and just bring my 2018 iPad with me. But the problem is while the 2018 iPad is an excellent tablet, it isn't the greatest productivity device out there. My solution, however, is just using the smaller version of the Apple Smart Keyboard. Now the Apple Smart Keyboard is a fantastic keyboard. Honestly, I've been using it for a year now. I love it, it's great. It has really nice tactile feedback, very responsive, and it also has a one month battery life. And if you didn't know, it does work with all of Apple's iPads. And if you wanna go pick it up yourself right now, you can probably find it used for about 50 bucks I did maybe even cheaper because I picked this up like a year ago so you probably even find it cheaper than that so it's a really high quality keyboard for not much money and it is still super compact now I don't have an iPad case so there's no easy way for me to make it stand up so I went on Amazon and just picked up a generic metal tablet stand now there are a few companies that make this stand I'll link below the one that I picked up I got it for about $14 but this stand is fantastic honestly it's very small very compact it can fit in your hand not only that it's made of metal so it's really nice and solid and feels tough and it's super sturdy you can bend this in a bunch of different angles and not worry about it falling over on you now if you're worried about the metal scratching up your ipad it actually has a nice rubber coating around basically the entire portion where your ipad will be sitting so it'll be nice secure firm and no scratches no damage to your ipad hopefully and it's definitely a must buy for anyone out there looking for a stand for the ipad especially since it does give you so many options for viewing angles and it's really really high quality build so definitely recommend it now for sound, it's no secret the 2018 iPad doesn't have the greatest speakers, especially since they're only located on one side. So you're not really gonna get great surround sound, especially when you have it in landscape mode. So what I did was just use this Create Metallics Bluetooth speaker. Now full disclosure, the company did send me this Bluetooth speaker to review months ago, but I never did it because I didn't really have any real ideas to review the speaker. But I think in this setup, it makes a lot of sense. It's really tiny. You can throw it in your bag and not even think about it. But being so small, it actually does get really, really loud. Out. and it actually does have a really good amount of bass. It's a really high quality speaker for only about 30 bucks. And just to give you a quick example, here's a quick sound test with the speaker. Keep in mind, I only have this microphone and the camera microphone, so you're gonna be listening to it through the camera microphone. Hopefully it doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> the speaker for a couple months I did think it was gonna be just cheap Chinese crap but it actually is pretty solid it actually has really great sound coming out of it especially for the price tag it is worth the money in my opinion but of course you can buy any Bluetooth speaker out there it doesn't matter for this setup now, I'm not gonna go over the Apple pencil because that's pretty much a given that you should probably own that you own any recent iPad now putting together this setup is pretty simple I do suggest that you put the Bluetooth speaker directly behind the middle of the stand just so you get nice surround sound from all directions that's really kind of the point of the Bluetooth speaker in the first place since you can't get surround sound with the iPad itself. But once you have it all set up, there you go. You have your really premium high quality iPad set up for productivity and just other random tasks you wanna do on it. I'm quickly losing light here, so I'm gonna wrap this video up. But that was just my quick video on a really good mobile travel friendly iPad setup for high-end productivity. All these products are fantastic. I'll leave links down below. But then again, you can change these up for really whatever you want, whatever Bluetooth keyboard you want, whatever Bluetooth speaker you want, whatever tablet stand you want. This is just what I picked up for me personally. But if you know any better suggestions, leave a comment down below. Let me know. Let me check it out. And if you like this quick video and hopefully all the footage and the audio and the colors look fine, it's going to be a real hassle to fix these colors. Please leave me a like and maybe even consider subscribing. I do camera and tech reviews. If you're interested in that, that'd be cool. But as always, my name is Joshua Joe Munoz. Stay sexy and I'll see you sometime.